People often doubt the suitability of 3D printing for functional induced parts. They see examples of people printing vases or dragons, but nothing seems practical. So when someone challenged me, I bet you can't 3D print ski boots, I thought I'd prove them wrong. And what's the worst that can happen anyways, apart from breaking my ankles? I began with 3D scanning my ski boots. I then reverse engineered it using VX Element. With the design ready, I loaded it into GrabCat Print and sent it over to our H350 printer. The Stratasys HD50 utilizes material called Nylon PA11. Unlike conventional PA12, it offers greater mechanical performance and thermal resistance. It's an exceptionally durable and resilient material, and even better, it is eco-friendly being made of castor seeds. This is exactly what we need for our 3D printed ski boots. After printing, the next step is depowdering. In a sealed booth, we're gonna break down the powder cake, and that's gonna leave behind our part intact. What's nice about this technology is that leftover powder that you're gonna see here is reusable in our next print. So now we're gonna grab both our parts, the top and the bottom part, and we're gonna head over to the Dimension PowerShot C. This is gonna be used to clean up that last bit of powder. The PowerShot C works similar to a sand blaster. It shoots glass beads at an extremely high velocity, which knocks off the powder while leaving behind the part undamaged. It also rotates the drum, which allows the glass beads to get into every nook and cranny. We're gonna go ahead and run the program, and this is gonna clean off our part. Now I want you to see here is the exceptional surface finish that we could get right off the machine. This amazing look can be further enhanced through dyeing or vapor smoothing. What truly stands out to me is how resilient this material is. I'm able to bend it to get my foot in. It is stiff enough to be used for skiing while just having enough flexibility to move. Using the right material for the application is important for end use parts, and thanks to this material, my ankles will live to see another day. Here you can see me enjoying an awesome powder day at Alpine Meadows, wearing my 3D printed ski boots. This was a great experience, and I hope it shows you the possibilities of using 3D printing for end use parts. You could find the ski boot STL in the description. Please use this file responsibly, as we don't want to see anyone get hurt. Until next time, I'll see you on the mountain.